but not waste land him, but more, somewhat more to do it. Bhakti is there. Then Krishna inspires him all kinds of such and everything. In Upanishad it has been told, there was yet Aruni and his Guru Dev. Aruni had come and Guru Dev asked him, he was serving for twenty-five years. One day Guru Dev told him, it is so much rainy, you should go to my field, water is going on from my field to other places, so you should shake the water. And then he took uh, and then there, he took him light, was trying and trying, but could not. So he gives up, lie down. Now, by coldness, his body was light. In morning, he could say, Oh, are you? Where you are? Where you are? Good day, I am here. What do I I could not shake the water, so I might myself. Oh, come on now. All the thoughts of knowledge should come in your heart. And one, in a second, all things. So, Guru must be like. We have also heard Uttara and his Guru Dev Gautama. No. In ancient pages, very pages, we see that anyone who wants to gain knowledge should go to Guru Dev and serve Guru Dev. So, Uttara also went to his Guru Dev. Ashram. And Guru Dev told that, oh, you should be Brahmachari and take care of my cows, graze my cows, and serve. He was grazing cows, but he was so healthy. Guru Dev told, oh, what are you taking that you are very healthy? Oh, when cops take mother of the cows, what milk it is? Oh, I see. Oh, don't take, don't take. Don't do this. But Vasudev do it. And then again he went and after some days he called to Dala. Oh, Dala, you are saying very healthy. What are you taking? Then he told that cows after chewing, oh mouth cows and oh don't do, don't do. Again. And then one day grazing cows, he was very thirsty and hungry. So there is a tree uh, from the leaves of that, some milk comes but it is very poisonous. And he took that and he became blind. And he went to Guru Dev's house and fell down in the bell. And Guru Dev was searching him. Uttala, Uttala, where you are? Oh, and I am in this way. Guru Dev kindly took him out of cell and told, Oh, for my serving. Follow me. So you have health and wealth, so all Vedic knowledge should as well come in your heart and it to okay. So we see also 
in Krishna Leela, Krishna and Krishnamdipani, and what he did with Brahman Sudama, he went to, went to forest to bring, collect some dry goods. And when he went there, oh, it was night and raining, raining, raining. Then he took the dry goods on his head and there was no way for deep water or shallow water. They stand in whole life. So Krishna Bhagavan even and in the morning Guru Dev came with Lalch and Hari came, Oh Krishna, oh Sudama, where you are? What doing? Oh Guru Dev, we are here. Oh night so much rain we could not return back to home. Oh for me, for the service of my wife and me, you have done so much. And then he told, oh, all kala, sixty-four kinds of kala, and everything, all knowledge will come. And you see, Rupa Swami, what Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, he is Guru Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Bhakti Rashtendu, apart, angelic, boundary. I am telling you, one God. And we give, get, oh, the Samhik Sinfu, which will lean money, and then you. These verses are more than Upanishad to Jalak and Auri. What they receive? So only that knowledge of Brahma. But they, Rukhmasani, what? What is in the Ujjal? Ujjal. What is Ujjal? Unnat Ujjal Rasa Shabhakti. So, in our life, in the Parampara of Srila Rukhva Swami, our Guru for gifts, Ujjal, Unnat Ujjal Rasa. So we are very lucky, you are very lucky. And now you should fix your goal. That Radha Darshan and begin from Upadesha Amritam. If you will avoid Rupa Goswami this teaching, Tannam Rupa Chaita Di Sukhatana Rupa Vena Rasana Mahesi Niyo Sitchan Praje Sadan Ravi Janaruga Kalam Naed Akhilam Ittu Padesha Sara. Prabhupada Das Goswami Manasitsha you should follow. Give up your anger, lust and all other things and be one pointed to Radha Krishna Yuga. By blessing, I am also praying to our Guru Bhar that they should strength to mercy on you that you should realize and you should follow all these things. Go Prema. Hare Krishna, after five sacrifices, the devotee has collected some alms for Guru Dev. They can come and offer their alms to Guru Dev. And after each session, some devotee has to receive their mantra feet here. Who has to receive, they can come and collect from me. Hare Krishna. So, who has not received their mantra feet here, please come and collect from me. And whoever collected all of the fire sacrifices, this come and offer to the Guru Dev. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. Um, one short announcement I'd like to make very quickly. Um, this is in regards to our very dear friend, our God Brother Gorsan Narpool. Um, first of all, on behalf of all the devotees here in Hilo, um, and also on the Hawaiian Islands, we'd like to thank all the devotees for coming so much. We're hoping you're having a wonderful festival. And if it wasn't for you, none of this actually would be possible, as well as all the devotees here from Hawaii. We'd like to thank them for helping. And especially Gordon Narpabu, he's given so many people, especially us here, so much inspiration to arrange this program. 
and not only during Good Islam, but also throughout the whole year. He is there in his home, over in Hilo. He inspired us so much. Every week we're going to his house and singing kirtan for two or three hours. So, um, what I'd like to announce is that we've all heard how much Guru Dev desires that he gets better, how much blessings he is giving God from Guru to recover. So, although we are very grateful that Guru Dev is here, it's very tragic as well, in a very awkward way, we're thanking Krishna, we're thanking Guru, that Guru Dev is with us. For me, as a very close friend, I can see every day, every minute, what to speak of every day, that he's not serving Guru, that he's not with Guru personally, with Guru Dev traveling, with Vaishnav, with under the direct guidance of them under the direct association is very, very difficult for him, very, very painful for him. And also for me as a friend, it's very hard to see what's going to go through this. So um, what I'd like to announce is that just like Guru was saying that what's going will get better, something has come up, an opportunity for us to, um, for what's going to recover. Because like I was saying, month after month, it's going on, what's going to not so much recovery is coming. So something we feel like Krishna, like Krishna and Guru's mercy, something has come in our lap, an opportunity for Gordon Dupu to recover. Um, we've done so many researches in the medical field as far as how to recover Gordon Dupu, how to help him recover. And what has come up is something called stem cell surgery. I won't get into the details of that, but if anyone would like to speak with me after, pretty much it's a very safe surgery and it also doesn't involve any fetus of a baby. It comes from the umbilical cord of a child after it's been born. So there's no controversy in this matter. Although they, although they don't do the surgery in America, still over overseas in foreign countries they're offering the surgery at a very affordable price. Not only that, it has a very, very high success rate of recovery for people in the same situation as Gorsuna So unfortunately Gorsuna Prabhu and his family, they're not so financially wealthy, so they're not able to um, by themselves get all these funds available in order for Gordon Nabu to travel there to China. We've selected a doctor in China that's very well known, very expert. But they don't have the sufficient funds to travel there to pay for the surgery. So starting about six months ago, we started a collection for, for Gordon Nabu going forward with recovery, whatever expenses were needed. I wanted to make sure that all the devotees here, they knew about what was going on. And also, if you could please spread the word, I know it show a great deal of character for us to provide support or help for our dear friend, our god brother, for some people their son, to do their dear son, Lord Sunderbu, so I'm pleased request seeing everyone. We have some pamphlets over here um, that describe very, in very detail Lord Sunderbu's surgery, what will happen, all the expenses we have already raised around ten or fifteen thousand dollars. Our goal is forty thousand dollars. So I know there's so many devotees here and if everyone just give ten, fifteen, twenty, fifty dollars then we'd be very, very close. Of course, if any kids voted to be there, could give more also. It would be very good. So, please, if you need any more information, contact myself or Sandri Kabiri. She has these, um, these flyers that give all these details. You can come to the back there. Thank you very much. Thank you. 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 I to provide service for the Vaishnavas. There's some very, very beautiful songs of the Acharya and Bhakti Nathakur, which are translated into English. All the proceeds, these CDs are here over here on the table, and all the proceeds that come from these CDs also go, also go to Sri Gorsan Prabhu and for his recovery. Thank you very much. Yeah.